All right, we're going to start this one out with taking a deep breath in. One, two, three. Hold at the top, let it out. One, two, three. Take a deep breath in. One, two, three. Let it out. One, two, three. We bring in the omnipresence of the all, which is my personal omnipresent. To be omnipresent means to step into the state of what already exists many places, many times in all realms, dimensions, and realities as another version of me. Everywhere that there is conscious life, we are made from exactly the same core substance. All things in the universe and multiverse are infinitely interconnected. No matter what form of energy is presenting itself, we represent at all times the larger whole. You, yourself, are a unique spark of high-frequency light that permanently resides within the vast body that you call God, awareness, the void, the all, the very existence itself. Your consciousness does not exist within your avatar because you have many avatars. Your body exists within your vast awareness, within the realm of your point of view in this game. Your consciousness is nothing outside of you. It is all within. It is all creation. In this phase of growth in this class, your microcosmic human is going to go macro. You are making a grand return to a greater remembering and expression of your true self. Your true self is omnipresent. It can be anywhere. It can be everywhere at the same time. Your expanded self is pure awareness. It is eternal. It is timeless. It is simultaneous. It is synchronistic. And it is very present right now and right here. Everything comes from your consciousness. Everything is part of the one body of omnipresent awareness. Wherever you focus your attention, wherever you focus your creation, wherever you focus your power and your commands for peace, for love, for magic, there will be the omnipresent of spirit supporting that coherent endeavor. It is your individual presence that is unified with the energy of this enlightened group mind and all the higher vibrational Christ consciousness and Jedi consciousness that is the influencing power of all realities. You are one with the all. You breathe with the all. You think with the all. You view with the all. You are more and more and more and more becoming one and aware of and bonded with and embodying within this omnipresent life force. You and I can project ourselves and go anywhere to do this at any time, any place. There is no time. You have unlimited assistance due to the very fact that you are interlinked with the all. You are interlinked with all aspects of your consciousness. You are interlinked with collective energetic frequency that is vibrating the patterns of unity and oneness. It is beaming this out at all times. To quickly transform all on one potentials, we know that when we invite these higher aspects of ourselves, that this omnipresent power always prevails. Let me say that again. This omnipresent power always prevails. It is always within me. It is part of me. It is the very heartbeat. It is the very breath of who I am and who I am active being at any time. Of course, time. There is no time. There is no space. It's not locality of time. And through this conviction, through this knowing, through this embodying, I can serve on the front lines with my energetic presence in any reality. I can help free conflicted life forms. I can direct needed streams of influence to transmute all imperfections within myself and within others because I choose to embody and live in oneness at all times. And as you, as I, have an intimate relationship with creation itself, with with the creator, which is I, and am in direct communication with my higher mind and heart intelligence, my personality becomes mastered, my body becomes mastered, my bank account becomes mastered, my relationships become mastered, and I begin to craft my life with grace, with magic, and with power. I begin to not allow external circumstances to negatively affect me in any way. I bring in and embrace and become a more refined and more soulful personality that more represents the totality and expansion of my being. I begin to assume the dominant position in life and I am charged with that great heartbeat sense of purpose I invite you to remember. 
I invite you to remember that you need no longer place an emotional priority on your human identity in this avatar. That you can recognize your body as a sacred portal temple to all time, all space that houses the omnipresence of the creator, which is you. I want you to clearly understand that you have control over your mind and your thought processes. I want you to clearly not be confused. I want you to understand that you can create thought forms that are clear and well-defined and instantaneous at your every command. When undesired thoughts come in, I recognize and remove them immediately and you can as well. I want to remind you that you are highly attuned and extra sensitive to a range of subtle vibratory influences due to that increasing polarization to the greater self, to the greater remembering. Are you remembering? I invite you to remember. I invite you to remember that it's possible to have a healthy aura and it's a healthy aura full of positive and high frequency life force. I invite you to remember that all layers are functioning from clearest efficiency, that your human energy field is a clear conductor of divine intelligence. I invite you to remember that you are transitioning into omnipresent awareness in an ever-expanding activity of evolutionary advancement. And it starts now and now and now and now with that remembering and with that choice to remember. Again, development of omnipresent awareness is silent, but it is very powerful and very crucial. It is a very important integration that will be set into motion through this class and through the work that you choose to do with one motivating impulse, and that is to remember the fullness of who you are. Will you remember? I invite you to remember. And so it is, and so it was, and so it will always be.